Hey everyone, this is Mina Irukai, number 26. Sorry, um, I'm still kind of sick, so um, if I cough in this video, I'm going to do my best to edit them out. Um, or if my voice sounds weird, I'm sorry, I'm still sick and hopefully it goes away soon. But let's get going. Okay, I have a lot of stuff to cover. Um, I'm just going to give you some general um, updates um, about TV shows and radio shows and stuff like that, and then I'll get on to the more serious side of this video. Um, it's nothing bad or anything, but yeah. So here we go. Tegomas are going to be on Music Station this Friday on the 21st. Um, they're going to sing Maho no Melody. And um, Masu is also going to be on Tuba Desio on the 22nd, which makes all of the news members having appeared on that show. Um, Masu was the last one. Koyama's been on it before, but his episode never aired uh, because of. I don't remember. I think it was Tsunami stuff. Um, but yeah, so I'm very excited for Masu to be on that show. Masu and food is always a good combination. Um, and Tegomas has a new radio show. It's called Tegomas no Radio. So Tegomas, Tegomas's radio. So going in the theme of all their albums, um, names. It's going to be on Wednesdays at, um, 1230 a.m. So it starts on the 26th, so I can't wait for that. Speaking of Tegomas, Tegomas no Maho went on sale um, today or yesterday, depending on where you are in the world, um, but it debuted at number one on the Oricon album charts, and it sold 29,441 copies. So congratulations, Tegomas! Um, my copy was shipped the other day, or I guess today, last night. Um, so I'm still waiting for it, and um, I will show it to you guys and do a little review once I get my copy. The rumor going around that um, Katoon and News will be doing a collaboration project. Um, they'll basically be joining forces and releasing singles um, from about from January until March, I think. Um, there's really no um, official source for this. I think it was in some tabloids, so don't know if it's true. Um, it sounds like a cool idea, but I would kind of want um, news to do something first by themselves now that they're this new news um, before they do anything with Katoon, but I would actually really like to see a um, collaboration between Katoon and news. I think that would be really awesome. And so, of course, um, about two weeks ago, the announcement that um, Miyama P and Rio were going to be leaving news, or they had left news, um, came out, and everybody was very sad. I was very sad. I'm still kind of very sad. Um, I've been kind of only half in news fandom lately. I've been really into like big time rush right now, but um, kind of my way to deal with the pain. But um, there have been several uh, comments. Made, mostly made by Koyama. Um, there was Yama P apologized in his J-Web and Ryo um, made a comment about it on Music Station when he was there with Kanjani 8. Um, and I still really don't know how I feel about them anymore. Um, I'm still kind of going through the grieving process because yes, I'm one of those fans. Um, so I don't really have anything to say about them right now. Um, but Koyama, um, Koyama's been the most outspoken mostly because he has had the, um, the most opportunity to, um, say things. Um, the first comment he made was on, at the end, I think, of, um, News Every the other day. Um, he, like, basically, one of the other newscasters was just like, Koyama, you have something you want to say about news or whatever. And so Koyama, um, um, I don't remember exactly what he said, but basically all of his messages have been the same, where it's just like, um, we're sorry that this happened, and um, the four of us are going to move on forward with um, being news and giving you the best news possible. Um, he also made a comment before his episode on the 11th of K-Chan News. Um, the episode of K-Chan News was pre-recorded, so it was Koyama and Tegomas being, like, ridiculous. Um, I actually haven't listened to that, the actual show yet, but, um, he did go in and record a, a comment, um, beforehand, and it was a really, really kind of, um, emotional comment, um, 
and you could tell that news was try not news uh Koyama was trying to like um be strong in it um because his voice sounded a little weird um either like like he was trying not to cry or he was just like or it was just like his really really serious voice and we don't hear Koyama's really serious voice um very often um <coughs> Shige and Masu also have radio shows but um to my knowledge they have not said anything because I think their shows have been um pre-recorded also so once they have a new show then um we will find out if they're going to say anything about it um I don't know if they're going to but um Koyama's basically been speaking for um the rest of news saying that um that this has been a really long this has been a long time coming and um that they wanted they wanted to keep news going um for themselves and for us um and some of the things I've been reading there's been tons of rumors and and things like that floating around the internet and that this um decision's been like since like June um so like they've been talking about it since June or July so that's like a really long time um and it's a really hard decision and it seems like what I've gotten from everything I've read and everything I've heard is that um Johnny's was going to disband news like totally um but then uh Koyama, Shige, and Tekomas they wanted they were the ones who wanted um news to continue um so I'm very happy that they wanted to continue because I'm actually very excited as sad as I am about this whole situation I really can't do anything about it except for support news as much as I can and I hope that you guys do too because um I think there's going to be a lot of opportunity for a lot of good things going on with this new news um there the four of them are all really close and they all hang out together like they went and trashed Shige's apartment together a few weeks ago um and so I think that um and they're all really creative and they love their fans and they want to give us the best possible show so hopefully it will be nothing but like sparkles and rainbows everywhere from now on because that's the kind of like image I get from them so I'm very excited to see what they do um and i I really want them to do something soon, but um, I think realistically, maybe we won't get anything until the new year, um, just because of the Tegelmas tour and everything like that. So um, I'm hoping that a new, that the next their next single comes out really soon because I'm really, really, actually very excited to see what they're doing um, or what they're going to do and what um, comes out of this whole situation. Um, so. There's also a way, um, there's a fan project going on that I have to tell you about. The deadline is on Friday, but it's by the News JE Twitter account, um, and they're doing like a Zuto News project. Um, it's kind of like the, um, the video they did, um, like the We Want News or I Love News project that was a few months ago, um, but this one's kind of like a support for, um, the new news, um, and it's... So the deadline's Friday, basically you take a picture with a sign that says like, I love news or something like that, um, and you send it in and then make a little video montage and you can like record some audio too, um, but yes, um, go and join that project, um, I'll be, hopefully I'll be able to enter it, I'm really busy with school and stuff. So I don't have anything else for you guys this week, um, this video is a little fast and a little rushed um, because I have tons of stuff to do um, but um, I wanted to get up the video and give you some of my thoughts about this new situation and stuff um, and thank you for all your comments in the last video um, I didn't respond to all of them um, but I did read all of them and I appreciate that everybody has their own opinion and I understand that everybody has their own opinion um, and I know that not everybody's opinion is going to be the same as mine um, and I really liked hearing about hearing everybody else's opinions um, about this whole situation. And um, I guess if you guys want, like, because I didn't really talk, I talked really fast about um, my thoughts on all of this because I don't want this video to be very long um, or too long because it's going to be very long right now. Um, but um, maybe 
I uh, will sit down and talk some more about it if you guys want me to. Um, I kind of just want to like move forward from now on, but um, if you want to have more discussion about it, just let me know and I will um, either pose like a question or um, talk about some stuff. Um, so yeah, um, I guess like on my video uploading is going to be very like um, irregular because I have to find times when my roommate isn't here because it's kind of creepy when I'm talking to the video camera by myself and she's here. So um, all my posting is going to be like kind of irregular. Um, I do have some videos that I want to upload soon. Um, so yes, um, that's all I have. So I will see you guys next week. I bought the most adorable little pig thing at the store the other day. Isn't it so cute? I named him Masu for, for obvious reasons.